A turbine that can capture wind from any direction. The O-Wind Turbine aims to capture inner city wind and turn it into electricity. This is an omnidirectional solution, so it can collect wind that's going up or down or all around. A bladeless wind turbine that can generate electricity from any direction, even in urban areas. This amazing invention is called the O-Wind Turbine, and it was developed by NASA and a team of engineers from the UK. It's so efficient and affordable that it could outbeat PV solar panels in 2024. Well, stick around and I'll tell you everything you need to know about this revolutionary device. Is it really the future of green energy or just a hype? Stay tuned to find out. The Owen turbine was invented by two students from Lancaster University in the UK who won the James Dyson Award in 2022 for their innovative design. The device consists of a spherical structure with vents that allow the wind to flow through it from any direction. The wind causes the sphere to spin around a fixed axis, which is connected to a generator that produces electricity. The device is small, lightweight, and easy to install, making it ideal for urban and residential areas, where space is limited and wind conditions are unpredictable. Unlike conventional wind turbines, the O-Wind turbine does not require a minimum wind speed direction, or height to operate, and it does not produce any noise or visual pollution. They have partnered with NASA and O Innovations, a company that specializes in omnidirectional wind turbines, to develop and commercialize their product. They have received funding from the Solar for All grant competition, which allocates $7 billion from the Greenhouse Gas Reduction Fund to bring solar energy to low-income and disadvantaged communities. They have also received support from the Bipartisan Infrastructure Law, which includes almost $58 billion for clean energy and power initiatives. They aim to launch their product in the market by 2024, and they have already received orders from customers around the world. Wind energy is one of the most abundant and clean sources of renewable energy in the world. According to the International Energy Agency, wind power accounted for 6% of the global electricity generation in 2022. Wind energy works by converting the kinetic energy of the moving air into mechanical energy, which can then be converted into electrical energy by a generator. The amount of energy that can be extracted from the wind depends on several factors, such as the wind speed, the air density, the swept area of the rotor, and the efficiency of the turbine. Solar energy, on the other hand, works by converting the radiant energy of the sun into electrical energy by using photovoltaic PV cells. PV cells are made of semiconductor materials that create an electric current when exposed to light. The amount of energy that can be generated from solar panels depends on several factors, such as the solar irradiance, the angle of incidence, the temperature, the shading, and the efficiency of the cells. Solar energy accounted for 3.4% of the global electricity generation in 2022, and it is projected to reach 17% by 2030. So how do the O-Wind turbine and the PV solar panels stack up against each other? Let's take a look at some of the key aspects that matter for renewable energy consumers and producers. Performance. The O-Wind Turbine claims to have a power output of 200 kilowatt hour, which is enough to power a small appliance or charge a battery. However, this output may vary depending on the wind conditions and the location of the device. The PV solar panels, on the other hand, have a typical power output of 250 kilowatt hour per square meter, which is enough to power a medium-sized appliance or charge a laptop. However, this output may also vary depending on the solar conditions and the orientation of the panels. Both technologies have a similar capacity factor, which is the ratio of the actual energy produced to the maximum possible energy that could be produced. The capacity factor of the O-Wen turbine is estimated to be around 20%, while the capacity factor of the PV solar panels is around 25%. Cost. The O-Wind Turbine is expected to cost around $200 per unit, which is relatively cheap compared to other wind turbines. 
However, this cost does not include the installation, maintenance, and transmission costs, which may add up depending on the site and the scale of the project. The PV solar panels, on the other hand, have a higher upfront cost, ranging from $1,000 to $3,000 per kilowatt, depending on the type and quality of the panels. However, this cost has been decreasing over the years, thanks to technological improvements and economies of scale. Environmental Impact Both the O-Wine Turbine and the PV solar panels have a positive environmental impact as they reduce greenhouse gas emissions and fossil fuel consumption. However, they also have some negative impacts, such as the use of materials, land and water, and the generation of waste and pollution. The o -Wen turbine uses less materials and land than the PV solar panels, as it has a smaller footprint and a simpler structure. However, it may also use more water for cooling and cleaning, and it may generate more noise and vibration, which could affect wildlife and humans. The PV solar panels use more materials and land than the o -Wen turbine, as they have a larger footprint and a more complex structure. However, they also use less water for operation, and they produce less noise and vibration, which could improve the quality of life and the biodiversity. Both technologies have a similar life cycle assessment, which measures the environmental impact of a product from cradle to grave. Potential Both the o -Wine turbine and the PV solar panels have a huge potential to expand and improve in the future, as they are still in the early stages of development and innovation. The O-Wind Turbine has the potential to increase its efficiency, reliability, and durability, as well as to scale up its size and power output. It also has the potential to integrate with other renewable energy sources, such as solar, hydro, and biomass, to create hybrid systems that can optimize the energy production and storage. The PV solar panels have the potential to decrease their cost, increase their efficiency, and diversify their applications. They also have the potential to integrate with smart grids, microgrids, and battery storage to create flexible and resilient systems that can balance the supply and demand of electricity. In conclusion, the o -Wine Turbine and the PV solar panels are both promising technologies that can provide clean and renewable energy for homes and businesses. However, they also have different strengths and weaknesses, and they may not be equally effective or feasible in every situation. The o -Wind turbine may be more suitable for areas where the wind is more abundant and variable, and where the space and the aesthetics are more constrained. The PV solar panels may be more suitable for areas where the sun is more consistent and intense, and where the cost and the incentives are more favorable. Ultimately, the choice depends on your preferences, needs, and goals, as well as on the availability and accessibility of the resources and the infrastructure. What do you think? Which technology would you prefer to use or invest in? Let me know in the comments below. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more content like this. Thanks for watching.